Hey dolls, welcome back to my channel. So for this Fat Twist Out tutorial, I wanted to give the Camille Rose Coconut Water Collection a try. I've been hearing so many things about this line, which has three different items, which is a leave-in, a styler, and a deep conditioner. This line is claiming to provide maximum moisture, so you know I had to put it to the test. Now this isn't a full wash day routine type of video, but I wanted to show what I used to cleanse my hair, which was the Sweet Ginger Cleansing Rinse. It has a light fragrance and it provides tons of slip and it's very soapy so no need to use a lot. The deep conditioner is very thick and creamy. I was instantly able to finger detangle my curls and it felt really soft and moisturized afterwards and just manageable which is usually what I tend to look for in my deep conditioners. Moving on to the leave-in conditioner. The consistency is a silky texture. It is thick, yet it feels non-greasy. To me, it feels like a lightweight conditioner and it was pretty moisturizing, which is a good thing. As for the scent, to me, it smells really similar to the fragrance from Victoria's Secret's Very Sexy Now collection. It's a really nice scent. It's one of, it smells like one of those perfumes from that collection. The Style Setter. I really like the styler because it gave me both moisture and hold. The consistency is smooth and creamy, but also lightweight. To me, I feel like it can be used both as a leave-in and or a styler. And it's always good to have one versatile product in your hair stash, you know? So now the fun stuff, moving on to the flat twisting. So you wanna part your hair and it would help to section off the parts that you're not using just to kind of get it out of the way. Then you're gonna grab two pieces of hair from the section you'll be working on and you're going to cross one strand over the other like you normally would a two strand twist, but now you're picking up hair to add to it. So you're still two strand twisting, but you're just picking up hair and adding it to your flat twist. Once you reach the hair that's just hanging, detangle it if necessary and proceed to two strand twist. Once you reach the ends of your hair, you can coil it around your finger. And if you can't coil around your finger, that's fine. You can use a perm rod to get that same coiled effect. If you already know how to flat twist, then you can just fast forward to see my finished results. But if you're learning, I want you to pay close attention. I will slow it down in another clip as well. All I can say is keep practicing. I can't stretch that enough. I've come a long way with flat twists. I sucked really bad when I started and it's not as bad as it looked. I promise if you practice, you definitely got this. So I sectioned my hair similar to Mini Marley's latest flat twist tutorial and I'm gonna link that in the description box below. Because my hair has recently been cut, I feel for short to medium length hair, how you part your hair plays a major role on how it falls later on for the takedown. Also, I left my hair to air dry overnight. Also, it's very important to make sure your hair is completely dry before you take it out. I'm going to lightly coat my hand with some oil and begin separating. You also want to take your time during the takedown. This can make or break your hairstyle. I say this in almost all my videos because if you don't take your time when you're separating, you can easily cause more frizz. Now you guys know I love me some volume, so I'm gonna pick at my roots just a bit. Not too much today, mainly just to get rid of those harsh lines. 
then just sort of play around with it to your liking and voila so i really did like this coconut water collection and expect a thorough review from me in the near future and i hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial give this video a thumbs up and i will see you guys next time bye Mwah.